Today's news, 20th September 2022. Today's special, Foundation Day of Railway Security Force. International news. Britain's Queen Elizabeth II's funeral was completed yesterday at St. George's Chapel in Windsor Castle. U.S. President Joe Biden has made it clear that the American forces will retaliate any attack by China on Taiwan. Women across the country cut their hair to protest the death of a young woman in police custody in Iran on charges of not wearing hijab properly. An Indian student who was injured and is being treated at the hospital in the shooting incident in Canada's Ontario province passed away yesterday. National News A special investigation team, SIT, consisting of three women officers, has been formed to investigate the sensational allegations of leaking objectionable videos of several female students in Punjab's Chandigarh University. Kavita Chavla, a housewife belonging to Kolhapur, Maharashtra in the famous television game show Kaun Banega Karod Pati 14 season series won a prize money of 1 crore rupees. The Supreme Court directed the Union Territories and states to formulate a scheme to recruit legal volunteers to stop offences against children for registration of cases of missing children in police stations under para. University Grants Commission, UGC, Chairman M. Jagdish Kumar informed that at least 48 universities in the country are ready to run joint courses with foreign higher education institutions. State News the Amravati Meteorological Center has informed that a surface circulation is continuing over the northwest-west central bay of Bengal, which will intensify over the coast by Tuesday and bring light to heavy rains with thunder and lightning along with gusty winds. President Draupadi Murmu approved the appointment of K.N. Satyanarayan as the director of the Indian Institute of Technology, Tirupati. Sources in the Central Education Department have informed that the President has approved the appointment of directors for eight other IITs in the country. The Telangana State has informed the Central Water Ministry that they will not agree to 66% share for Andhra Pradesh and 34% share for Telangana on black water distribution, and 50% share of water should be shared between the two states. Sports News Indian young player Pragyananda won the first three rounds of the Julius Baer Generation Cup online chess tournament yesterday. The Supreme Court has directed the Secretary of the Sports Ministry to discuss with the International Olympic Committee, IOC, the appointment of a neutral person as a new president of the Indian Olympic Association. Asian Games medalist and Arjuna Awardee Poovam has been banned for two years by the anti-doping appellate panel, ADAP, for failing a doping test. As part of the three T20 match series to be held between India and Australia cricket teams, the Indian team will play Australia in the first T20 match in Mohali today. District News Regional Joint Director of School Education Vekta Krishna Reddy has directed the headmasters and teachers that every teacher should attend the schools with a proper lesson plan and teach in the classroom using modern methods. He unveiled the posters for the Kaushal competitions organized by the Andhra Pradesh Council of Science and Technology, APCOST, and Indian Council of Science. Naga Shelja, PD. ICDS informed that interviews are being conducted on 23rd and 24th of this month for the candidates who have applied for the vacancies in the Anganwadi centers of the district.